Hey guys, Tennessee Frank here. Uh, we're going to do a quick look at a, a couple of the, the Lumo Pals um, little portable solar panels. Uh, they're, they're pretty decent little solar panels for the money. I mean, um, the little 40 watt is heavily discounted now. It's like 35% off. And then the 60 watt uh, they have at 15% off. Um, but you, you get some pretty good accessories. They give you a, a USB-C cable. You get a little variety of adapters to go with it. They give you a couple little hooks so you can hang it up. Uh, you do get a cable. And the, uh, the cable, here's one that's undone. It's a fairly long cable. I mean, pr pretty decent length. And it is 5521. So uh, I noticed most of the power stations today are running 5521. Uh, that seems to be kind of a standard that they've uh, adopted. And like I said, if you need a different one, they do have like your 5525, your little 4.58 millimeter. You know, some of your more common. I'm not sure about this one. I've never seen that connector on one. But uh, yeah, they give you a little, little extra connectors so you can adapt it over. Um, but we're going to take these out. It's a, a nice sunny day. Um, it's a little bit cooler, so they should work fairly efficiently. And uh, we're just going to see what we're going to get. Of course, you can see here you got a, a small charge controller. And uh, you're going to have a 5521 DC port. You do have your uh, USB-C and a uh, USB-A, and it's a 3.0. It's red. Here's the specs. Whoop, bump the camera. Here's the specs. Uh, you can pause and read if you'd like. You can see 24.6 volt open circuit, 20 volt, 2.14 amp versus the, uh, the 60 watt panel. With it, um, you are getting two of the USB-A uh, 3.0s quick charge. 1C and, and 1DC port. So you do get an extra A port. And we can go ahead and look at the specs on it. This one, the voltage is a 23 volt, 18 closed circuit, max voltage. and But the amps is up, 3.5 amps. So voltage is a little lower, but the amps is up. And that's where they're getting the uh, 60 watt. Uh, this is a four panel. This is a six panel, so theoretically these put out 10 watts per panel. That'll put out 10 watts per panel. You do six and you get 60, four, you get 40. But we'll get out. Um, let's hook it into uh, one of my little power stations and we'll just read how much we're getting. So let's run outside and we will be right back. Okay, we got the little 40 watt set up. Angled pretty good to the sun. Got it hooked in to my little Go Labs. And I don't know if you can see on here, but it is it is pulling in 28 watts, which is not too bad. Now we're going to go ahead and unhook that, and I'll put 60 watt on, and we'll see what we get out of it. Okay, we got the 60 watt set up. See, there are six panels. And let's see what we're getting on our display if we can read it. You can see, hopefully, you can see, we are getting 36 watts. So, about nine more watts over the, uh, over the 40 watt panel. So, uh, yeah, which would be the better buy? Let's go back inside, get back on the tabletop, and we'll talk a lot about this a little bit more. As you can see from our test, 27 watts versus 35. So, uh, for this supposedly having 20 more watts, you're only getting, uh, what, about another 7 so price wise um, with the discount these are running around 45 these guys are about 68 
personally, if I'm going to spend money, I think I'd rather almost go with the 40 watt. Uh, even though it's less wattage, you're going to pay less, and you're going to come real close to the 60 watt. Plus, it's going to be uh, a little bit thinner, be a little easier to carry. Of course, they both have nice carry handles. You got your uh, your straps here that hold everything together. You know, these are really, I think they're really well built. But uh, yeah, for, for the difference in wattage, 27 versus 35, especially when this is rated at 60, I mean, if this would have been 40, 45, yeah, I might say go with that. But for the price point, I think the, the 40 watt is the winner here. Um, you're getting 27. Um, I know the other day I did get 30 out of one of these testing it. So you're getting real close. Uh, I think that's about the best I've ever got out of these. I got a couple of them and about 35 or so uh, is the best I ever did get out of them. So, I mean, the choice is yours. L Lumo Pals are making some uh, pretty decent little solar panels. They make some decent little power stations too, if you can find them. But, uh, yeah, your mileage may vary. It just depends on what you want. And you get the same accessories with both. So, just a real quick video. You know, which one you pick is up to you. I honestly kind of like this little 40 watt. I think it would be a good way to go. You know, you're, you're getting 27, close to 30 out of it. So, that's not too bad for a small power station. Um, so, yeah, if you like what you see, like, share, subscribe. And uh, like I always say, either we stand up for our rights or we can sit by and watch them go away. Y'all have an awesome rest of the day. We'll talk to you later. Tennessee Frank out of here.